Um, how will you deal with the stress and pressure of being a first-time coach with a franchise that expects to win titles all the time? I grew up in Saginaw, Michigan. I was shot in the face by accident April 5th, 1988. You go through something like that, it's going to do one or two things. It's going to make you fearful or fearless. It made me fearless. I don't feel no pressure. It's basketball. I'm going to talk about some of my military representatives over across the seas, fight for our democracy. That's pressure. This here is a challenge. And, and it's, it's, it's something that can be navigated. We have a great partnership, me and Rob, that's going to grow and continue to build. We have great ownership group. We have great people around our building, great people involved in our personnel decisions. I, I look forward to it. Like, I, I, wanted to hit the, I wanted to talk. I talked to LeBron my first day in the gym, and I wanted to start training camp the next day. I got so excited. And just to hear his excitement um, over the phone, it's like, Man, and, and to see Russ and talk to AD and talk to Russ, and it just, they, they, these guys, you know, they, they're not great by mistake, and they want to be able to do something. And I know all of them feel this way. They want to be able to do something collectively that's great, put another banner in this building. And the, it starts right now. So that's, that's just a challenge. That's not pressure. I've seen real pressure in life. So to me, this is fun. This is something that's going to be joyful something we're going to look back on, remember these days, and when we're popping bottles of champagne somewhere, celebrating another banner going up. Hello, I'm Mark Brown. Get more great ABC7 content by clicking the subscribe button for our YouTube channel. And download the ABC7 Los Angeles streaming app on Fire TV, Android TV, Apple TV, and Roku to watch on your TV.